Every organization would like their API program to be successful. Quality assurance strategy is about detecting and correcting problems during the SDLC to ensure APIs are reliable and consumers can utilize them to deliver high quality digital experiences. Let's look at the digital value chain again. Consider where quality assurance should be implemented. In most organizations, we quickly identify the technical areas. Your backend servers and APIs must be clear of defects to ensure you are generating great and quality digital experiences. However, focusing solely on protecting code integrity is only the start of a quality assurance strategy. Your team should actively participate and have a culture of continuous quality assurance as well. Developers and key team members must consistently strive to find, prevent, and correct issues. Quality assurance should also be an active process in deploying your connected experiences. This can be automated through a continuous integration and delivery tools that can also help with unit testing, integration testing, and performance testing. The principle of automation and quality is an essential part of digital transformation. CICD often helps reduce rework and technical debt while maintaining quality throughout the entire development lifecycle. Some of the benefits of CICD with the help of automation include increasing the speed of finding, fixing code and integration errors, decreasing the cost of finding and fixing those errors, increasing the dev team's confidence in code stability, increasing the dev team's frequency in releasing the code to production. But successful quality assurance strategies must also occur at the customer level. Leveraging your customers to receive feedback, test new features and services, and validate user experiences must be an integral part of your continuous improvement process and ensure that your organization is able to keep your customers happy. Let's take a look at the details within quality assurance. Here are a few factors to consider when building your quality assurance strategy. Reducing risks is critical in your QA strategy. The risk of a bad experience reaching the customer can be greatly reduced when regression testing and continuous quality assurance is in place. Be sure that your team understands what the objectives, requirements, and acceptance criteria are for new features and changes to your APIs. The key is to make sure your requirements are clearly aligned with your business needs and stakeholders' expectations. Does your team have the right technical skills and capacity to ensure quality assurance is being met? As testing becomes increasingly automated, QA engineers are replacing manual testing efforts. Your API team and testers should have automation testing and QA skills, as well as understanding of the key test frameworks in the development cycle. Understand how your products work and how the tools can be used to help maintain your quality assurance. Each tool in your CI CD process, along with your API platform, can be leveraged in your QA strategies. The business must support a culture of quality assurance and continuous improvement as well. This means including QA further upstream in the requirements and design process, and also collaboration between the product owner and the QA to mutually define acceptance criteria and test cases. Finally, also consider any organizational regulations that are required. These may also drive quality and may require specific standards to satisfy feature release. Having your regulations understood by everyone on your team will prevent needless cycles to approve new features. So let's summarize everything with a few key strategies to build quality into your SDLC. The first is to make time to test. Unfortunately, some teams often look at QA as an afterthought. Only when something breaks does the questions come up, where is our quality assurance? Have dedicated time and QA role embedded in your daily routine to test your APIs and validate quality. Second, everyone is responsible for quality. As we discussed earlier, everyone is responsible throughout your digital value chain and software development lifecycle to test, detect, prevent, and correct issues. Do not hand off QA to someone else. Follow through on every issue. Third, documentation is essential. The more your team gets comfortable with documenting product features and product issues, the better your quality will get. This should happen at every layer of your experiences, backend, frontend, and APIs. We discussed Gherkin as a great way to document both a requirement and a test scenario at one time. This smart way of writing saves a ton of team time and helps to enable everyone to weigh in. 
Furthermore, Gherkin can be converted directly into programmatic test scripts, saving even more time. Fourth, automate testing, but don't avoid manual testing. We discussed on your CI-CD pipeline can assist in quality assurance processes by standardized testing, deployment, and integration. But don't solely rely on automated testing. Your team should always get involved and conduct manual tests to validate the automated testing is working properly. Fifth, test early and often. Quality is about consistently delivering quality experiences. Your code, designs, APIs, and user experiences should constantly be reviewed and supported to ensure continuous quality assurance. Testing in each sprint right after the code is developed is a great way to catch bugs before they are a larger impact. Oftentimes, the QA and the developer will sit side by side together at the end of the sprint to do a QA walkthrough. If something's found, the developer will fix it on the spot and no defect ticket even needs to be logged. Finally, in six, include your customers in the process. Your customers are, and developer community can help ensure quality. Invite them to a user testing at the end of the sprint or have them play with an alpha or beta version of your APIs. Building a pilot customer group can be one of your most valuable assets. Listen to what they have to say and issues they report to you. Everyone should be involved with the quality assurance. Hopefully, you found a few strategies in the presentation to help build a successful quality assurance strategy to support your APIs, any ongoing development, and customer experiences. If you want more information, check out the community for eBooks, articles, and other related topics. Thank you for watching.